this, uh, this one year, my father had his shop and he decided for whatever reason that he wanted a new wall on the front of his shop. So he tore down <laughs> probably about uh, you know, 16 feet high and probably about uh, 30 feet long. He just completely tore the wall down and my brother and I had to dig a six foot hole. <laughs> We for would the mix foundation, it for yeah, the foundation. Right. We would mix in the concrete by hand. Yeah. A year and a half. We were building this wall for a year and a half. Every day after school, we were coming, mixing concrete, putting it in the hole, doing it. Yeah. And it was just myself and my little brother. And I remember standing back, looking at that wall, saying, there's going to be a hole here forever. A year and a half later, we laid the, the final brick. And my father stood back and he looked at me and my brother and said, hey, don't y'all never tell me that you can't do something and walked into the shop. And I learned very young, you, you don't try to build a wall. You don't set out to build a wall. You don't say, I'm going to build the biggest, baddest, greatest wall that's ever been built. You don't start there. You say, I'm going to lay this brick yeah. as perfectly as a brick can be laid. There will not be one brick on the face of the earth that's going to be laid better than this brick that I'm going to lay in this next 10 minutes. Yeah. And you do that every single day and soon you have a and wall. And soon you have a wall. wall. Yeah. And I think psychologically the advantage that that, that gives me over, over a lot of people that I I'm, have been in competition with in different situations is it's difficult to take the first step when you look how big yeah, exactly. the, the task is. The task is never huge to me. It's always yeah, me one brick. Me too. I mean, it, it is amazing how it, you know people are paralyzed. The separation of talent and skill is one of the the the, the greatest misunderstood concepts for people who are trying to excel, who have dreams that want to do things. Talent you have naturally. Skill is only developed by hours and hours and hours of beating on your craft. There's no easy way around it. No matter how talented you are, your talent is going to fail you if you're not skilled. I want to represent an idea. I want to represent possibilities. I want to represent the idea that you really can make. Being realistic is the most commonly traveled road to mediocrity. Why would you be realistic? What's the point of being realistic? There's a, a redemptive power that making a choice has, you know, rather than feeling like you're at a effect to all the things that are happening make a choice right you just decide what it's going to be who you're going to be how you're going to do it just decide and then from that point the universe is going to get out your way i want to do good yeah. i want the world to be better because i was here